Daniel, tell me about this one. Look, yeah, so this so is one colorful. of our, our small signatures here at Happy, our signature sea urchin we call it, simply as that, sea urchin and cauliflower, which is a very classic flavor combination, right? So as soon as people started eating um, mm -hmm. sea urchin and, and started cooking with it and experimenting it, cauliflower was um, even in the Asian in the Asian cuisine, but more in the in the Western cuisine, it's a very classic flavor combination for sea urchin. So these are actually cauliflower. <clears throat> yes. So there's two preparations of cauliflower in this dish. Mm -hmm. On the bottom of the shell, underneath the uh, the sea urchin um, tongs, we have a white cauliflower puree. Mm -hmm. um, um, which is um, blanched cauliflower mixed with butter and a little bit cream um, and salt. Very, very pure. Then it's topped with the sea urchin tongs and then to give it a contrast in, in color and in, uh, in flavor, uh -huh. um, we have a pickled cauliflower, a purpled pickled cauliflower on top. So, um, and that gives you like these little acidic flesh when you eat it, right? Oh. Because the sea urchin is very rich and that's it. And then we have a little uh, little green um, decoration from the Afila crest, which is a peat crest um, tendril. And that's it. And then you, the idea is you take a spoon, uh. dig in, have a little bit of everything and then just enjoy it. Okay. You go first. Right. Okay. To the bottom. Make sure you have Sea urchin, some cauliflower, and the cauliflower. Oh, yeah, 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 oh, yeah, 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 Cheese. It's rich, it's creamy, and the sea urchin flavor. Speechless. It complements the cauliflower and the other way around, right? It's 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 a super classic combination. Does it come with purple color so or the cauliflower after itself you is by nature already mm. purple? But you see when you bite it, it's still crunchy, right? And it gives you that little texture difference because the cauliflower puree and the sea urchin are so smooth and so uh, creamy in texture mm -hmm. so we wanted to add a little little bite to it right and we, do, we like to play with the same flavor as really the flavor of yeah. the cauliflower it's Superb. Try it. Well, I have one every day, you know, it's like... <laughs> no way, you should have ten. <laughs> Whenever we plate it, you know. Oh, I would love to have one every day. Well, it's on the menu here, you can come by every day. Sick John will be pretty. Eating more. Sea urchin. <laughs> How do you make the sauce though? So basically you clean the cauliflower, cut it in pieces, cook it in salted water, drain it, and then we blend it with some butter and a little bit of cream and then adjust the seasoning. And that's mm. it, pass it through a chinoise, so it's super smooth and silky. It's so smooth, yeah. it doesn't taste anything like those butter, but very creamy. Yeah. Which yummy, is, right? Um, Finish it. Thank you, Don't Kusher.